What's up guys, today let's take a look at this nice Spider Guard sweep series performed by Kaina Duarte at the last Europeans Championship. So Kaina is starting here from his close guard, he already has his double sleeve control, he's gonna start opening his guard, stepping on his opponent's hip to get a little angle so he can get his Spider Guard going here. His opponent is doing a good job with this combat base, one knee up, one knee down, connecting knee to elbow together to prevent Kaina from reclosing his guard. And also to prevent Kaina from shooting a triangle choke here, Kaina's hip cannot go through this structure here, through the elbow and knee connection. So one way to deal with this situation here is by trying to disconnect elbow and knee of course, getting a shin on shin guard here where Kaina can start extending his opponent's leg here behind his body, dropping his knee to the ground. And that's exactly what Kainan is going to try to do, he's hipscaping here a little bit to get that shin on shin. Okay, the problem is that Kainan is too much on his side here. I made a video a few days ago explaining how to do this technique, so I'm getting my spider guard there, I'm getting a little angle to get my shin on shin, but as soon as I get that shin on shin, now instead of staying on my side, I go back flat on my back, square to my opponent, so I can actually pull his sleeve and extend his leg in a straight line. My knee here is checking his leg, is checking his knee, so my opponent doesn't open the knee, killing the straight line here. Let's take a look there, I pull the sleeve, I extend my leg, dropping my opponent's knee to the ground, separating his knee from his elbow, and now I can start shooting my triangle, stepping my opponent's hip, shooting my hips all the way up, catching his neck, and then locking that triangle. Going back to Kainan here, he's too much on his side, his knee is wide open, not blocking his opponent's knee, so the angle of the push and pull is a little bit off here. If Kainan tries to extend his leg, he's gonna extend his leg into this direction here, pulling the sleeve into this direction, not what we are looking for, we are looking for a straight line. So Kaina tries to execute there, tries to pull his sleeve and extend his leg, but the angle here is off as we can see, he's pushing his opponent's leg this way. His opponent recognizes that, stands up to kill the sweep, goes around a little bit with that Toriando pass, but they eventually land on the same position again. His opponent has a combat base, Kaina starts hipscaping, get that shin on shin again, and he's gonna try again, but he's still on his side, his knee is wide open, if his knee is wide open then his opponent can slip his knee out, opening his knee, killing the angle of that straight line here, Kaina won't be able to push his leg behind his body. So Kaina recognizes that it's not working, so he's gonna change a little bit here. He has still the spider guard on his opponent's forearm there, he's gonna change the spider guard now, he's gonna get a spider on this arm here, so he can use the far leg there to push his opponent's knee, right? A basic spider guard sweep by pulling the sleeve, pushing on the knee and driving the spider guard here towards the ground to land on top. But that also fails because Kaina ends up missing his opponent's leg there. He goes for the sweep, misses the leg, he readjusts himself, tries to get his foot again in position to push that leg, but his foot stays here in between his legs, not being able to push that base leg. So Kainan is gonna change again, that foot that was trying to push the leg is gonna come here to this near leg and get a reverse de la Riva hook, right? That hook is gonna block his opponent's leg here, so Kainan can dump his opponent right here now to this side. Kainan could also use his left arm here that's controlling his opponent's far sleeve, let go that sleeve and control his opponent's ankle here to stabilize his leg even more, controlling this leg, preventing him from reposting this leg, but Kainan felt that this hook was enough, it was tight enough, so he's gonna sweep his opponent right here into his left arm, falling on his butt. So now he can come on top, punching his opponent's sleeve down to the ground in order to take top position. Nice sweeping series by Kaina Duarte.